And O'Shea Jones, bronze medalist in women's welterweight boxing. Congratulations to both of you. Welcome, welcome, welcome. How you feeling? Good, good. Happy to be here. Yes. I want to go back to May of, um, of, of this year because I, I understand that this was right around the time where you were told you'd be heading to the Olympics and then a fire breaks out in your house. Tell me about getting from that moment to getting to the medal stand. Well, it was really like an emotional roller coaster. So when I, um, when I was in the fire, um, I almost died basically. As soon as I got out, you know, my, my room collapsed right where I was at. And then five days later, I got a call saying I was gonna be representing the United States of America. So it was just like, what am I gonna do next? What, I'm go what, what am I even gonna wear there, you know? Yeah. But it was, just, it was just a blessing. You went from a low to quite the high. Right. How did you get into boxing? Um, I got in, into boxing because I was always in competition with my little brother. I always wanted to do what he do. He used to wrestle. I wanted to wrestle. I bought him up. He used to box. I wanted to box. I wanted to put him up. I always <laughs> wanted to be better than my brother. And this is the first time that, that this weight class was included at the Olympics, right? Yes, yes. I am the first welter, welterweight to even medal, like period. I'm the first to represent USA. What do you think this means for the future of women's boxing in our country? Um, I think this means a lot for women's boxing. I think I'm getting more exposure to women's boxing, getting the, um, the sport more like known. You know, I'm letting the women know that we can be, we can do the same thing that males do, but maybe even better. Uh, yeah, I would say, especially when it comes to boxing. Yeah. <laughs> I, wouldn't want to, I wouldn't want you taking a swing at me. Uh, <laughs>